love it, but just ridiculous. The crazy thing is, it's like, he does so much damage, but if you get hit by a couple stray hits from the wrong character, you just die. Yeah. I start off with a taunt, I like it. <laughs> now it's gonna be dangerous for Pichu being covered in ink. Cause it gets dangerous for Pichu when he racks up damage. I'm playing it safe, I like that, I like that. Yeah. Doesn't want to commit to anything when he's covered in ink. He knows he dies early. Keeps the rapid jab going. <laughs> A star just kind of falling into it. Okay, both these guys just playing really solid neutrals, trying to poke at each other, figure out what they want. Ooh, that back air into the grab is really good. Covering him with ink again. It's gonna be really dangerous. If Pichu gets hit just a couple times, he's well within kill percent. Right, I mean, he's one roller away from probably just about death right now. Like, he's so light. Not having anything without roller. Actually, really smart of Pichu to do a lot of jump aerials in this matchup. I would think because the roller is something they're really looking for. Absolutely. Ooh, not able to punish that forward smash, just about. Yeah, Pichu is very hard to punish with smash attacks. His ending lag is, he has some for sure. It's just not a lot. Yeah. So, a smash attack like a forward smash from Inkling it's just won't quite cut it on those things. <laughs> just <laughs> jumping over each other. It looks like <laughs> playing leapfrog right there. I like it. Forward air just about going to take it. And that back air will kill for sure. What a strong back air. But, you know, Pichu's been racking up damage on himself too, so he's got to be wary of that. I'm wondering if we're going to see JDB just try and finish it. Yeah, I'm wondering how that'll turn out. You know, if he gets impatient, just wants to secure the kill. Right. Yeah. Perfect. Beautiful. That'll do it. Back to a neutral game. Yeah. And we didn't see him just rush it. He waited, kind of got in, snuck underneath, got that up air in there. That was good. Yeah, that punish was very well timed, very well, very well thought out. Didn't take much, but it took the right timing. Oh, gets cut. Oh, calling out the mash. Very nice with that back air right at jump height. Very yeah. smart. Excellent conversion right there. Ooh, Ooh, another him again. Oh, trying to call out that rollback. That was actually really smart. If that had worked, Pichu would have absolutely died. Yes. And I don't imagine Pichu can take another up smash like that. No, no. A couple more interactions, and Pichu will have either get gotten hit a couple times or hurt himself a couple times. He doesn't survive too good. Right. Do the Inklings have any kill throws? Um, I don't think they have kill throws. They have the... The throw confirm into up air. I don't remember if it's up throw or down throw. It's really tight. I think Pichu's out of range of that now. Wow. Missing the spike, but JDB getting the tech from the, the, the hit in. That was really good. Oh, I oh. guess they do have a kill throw. All right. 150%. Well, one fifty percent. One fifty on Pichu might not really be a kill throw. <laughs> You're, right. You're right. But <laughs> it definitely did kill in that situation. That's exactly what he needed. I'm sure he knew that percent. Yeah. And I'm guessing A Star's looking for that forward tilt, some kind of smash, even the back air. I mean. Yeah, it's Pichu for it will definitely do the job. And it's so low committal. The only commitment really is the damage it does. Yeah. Very patient play from both of these players. I really like how oh. JDB has been Feeling throwing himself. out the barracks. Yeah, get the little taunts in there. JDB has been throwing out those inkling back airs though really well and just kind of covering that zone behind them because you know Pichu just wants to run at you and throw out everything they can. He's got those little baby hitboxes. Yeah. And if you can make him afraid to commit to one of them, right. you're in a good position. And I, I do like that JDB is very content in not being the aggressor because he knows how hard it is for Pichu to get in without making the right decision. Right. Especially when you're inkling and all of your movements so fast too. Yeah. And if he misses, you can punish pretty easily with something that'll start at least a small combo. So he's playing this very intelligently. Both of these guys are trying to make the other approach. And that's kind of what you have to do in this. Yeah. Pichu has good approach options, but if you mess up, it's very easy to die for it. And this is a really close game. Yes. Oh, not able to get the punish out there. That's going to take yeah. it for sure. That, that force smash is so powerful. Yeah. It'll kill heavy. Will it? Will it? All right. Well, Peach is, uh, uh, Peach is pretty good. At, cool. at ledge? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It's strong. A-star taking game one there. JDB 
It was I haven't very seen close, them. though. This yeah. could go any direction. Oh, absolutely. Looks like we're going Battlefield. All right, what's the, what's the music counter pick? This is important. I didn't get to read it. Okay, I guess it's not that important. I don't know. Okay, JDB switching over to Mario. Not really liking the Inkling matchup right there. Against this Pikachu. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to think, how does this matchup go for Mario? I know he wants grabs, throw combos, and he kills really early from a lot of them with this new up. But I'm wondering how he struggles against Pichu trying to get in. Looks like he dropped the shield a little bit too early there. Ooh, he went for a big forward smash there. Yeah, another one. Punish. That's so hard to punish, though. Very hard. Peach, you definitely a quick little guy. But it looks like JDB did something right. He's got A star on the ropes. It's looking like the the flood is. What a call out. Okay, All right. that'll take it. The Flood looks like one of the reasons he wanted to switch to Mario, I think. And, you know, disrupting that uh, recovery is really important. If you can get him off stage. That's a good point. He could be trying to do something with that. And he's gotten a lot of mileage off of those up airs, even stock one. Perfect. I like the idea with the Force Smash. Pichu landed with just... Oh, oh no! Missing that air dodge. I think that's going to be something we see less of as the game goes on because everybody's trying to get used to, you know. Yeah. I can air dodge the ledge. It's a really good option. Got to hit it right or you die. It's yeah. kind of risky. But Ooh. I like that call yeah. a lot. Very smart. Yeah. He thought he was going to run up and oh, not, not able to recover. Oh. JDB doing very well game two here. It's about even now, even as far as SDs go. Since <laughs> yeah. <laughs> JDB messed up. It was the unintentional gentlemen's. Yeah, why not trade? It's Pichu, and when you're up a stock, absolutely. Okay, so he's using that dash attack from Mario, trying to catch that uh, recovery. Yeah, it's really hard to catch Pichu's, but if you do, very good reward. Yeah. Because being off stage is game. It's incredibly difficult to deal with. You have so many less options. The back throw off stage. Yeah, oh, there nice it is. catch right there. Ooh. Oh. And that's going to do it, yeah. You're right. He's looking for that flood disruption. Flood plus Kate plus Mario doing Mario things. Yeah, if you put Pichu in an odd place where he has to up B where you're vulnerable to, to that flood, it's a kill. Yeah. Doesn't Water matter. Doesn't matter whose percentage is what. Is you're, you're just dead. Yeah. Well, I mean, by doing that too, he's essentially told him you cannot recover high. Yes. If you recover above the stage, I am going to use these water boxes to push you off. Like, That's a really good point. Yeah. It's really cutting off his options as far as getting back to stage once he's off and having less options to recover in this game. With as few as you have, it, it makes things a lot more difficult. Yeah. Well, that end, he showed him, too. If you recover to the ledge, I'm going to try and dash attack you. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, yes. he's he's shown him. I wouldn't even say he's shown him his trump card. He's just shown him, hey, this is what I can do. And I'm excited to see what's going to happen. Mm -hmm. But it, maybe we're getting a character change here. He played Lucina in Smash 4, didn't he? Oh, did he? Star? I think so. I think he played Lucina in Rosalina. I believe he was playing some Lucina yesterday in doubles as well. And okay. it, was, it was doing quite well. I mean, Lucina's a fantastic character in this game. Yeah. Still has really solid recovery. She's always had really good edge guarding, mm -hmm. and that carries over to this game incredibly well. Yeah. <laughs> She's going for an aerial offstage. You have one air dodge, and you might die if you're too low. Oh, got the taunt start out to come at me. Okay. I, like I like it. It's a shame Mario can't get big anymore with his taunt. 
I was so disappointed they took that out. I like the thumbs up, but I missed the, the, the traditional get big. Yeah, I know a lot of Marios that, that really missed that one. All right, well, both players just kind of feeling out the spacing between these two characters. Really smart. Neither of them going in. And it's looking like A-Star's getting what he wanted with this Lucina fix. He, ha she, he has that, that range that he wants against Mario yeah. to really wall him out effectively. Because with Pichu, trying to keep Mario out is really hard. And that's, that's a really good thing to do against him because he wants a grab or he wants a tilt or something to get a combo started. And he's not really, he doesn't have a lot of range besides his back air. Yeah. If you're comfortable with this character and he can wall out Mario really well. It's going to do the job. Yeah. Ooh, that was, wow. And that flood's going to kill. There to flood. Beautiful right there. They're just sending him out just far enough. But having the presence of mind to use the flood right away. Yeah. Really good by JDB right there. And it wasn't even like, I'm recover I'm, I'm messing up your up so you're helpless. It's just like, no, you're just in the blast zone. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's incredibly smart. From the Nair, there was no chance. But not, not taking too much damage, but this is like the first time he's gotten any kind of damage at all. Uh, JDB since coming back from his or since A-Star took, lost that first stop. I like the cape, kind of throwing it out there above the ledge, just saying like, hey, yeah, come out here and fair me. See what happens. It also disrupts the timing for his recovery too. So if you yeah. try to do, so oh, oh, he he tried to drift. Yeah. Not quite enough to get back. It was a good idea because he knew Lucina wanted to edge guard, but slight miscalculation there. There's that Nair again. And I don't think we've got a flood charge online. But I don't see why. I, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw that Nair to flood again off stage. It worked really well. And it was it didn't seem to be something that really was affected by percent. <laughs> <laughs> we got Wet and Wild Mario coming on stage right here. I love it. What is he doing? This is wild. Is he going to time him out? OK. <laughs> You either get fire or water. Or one of the two. Oh! What a Beautiful funny way to get in his head. Oh, I love it. I like it too that he did that after he lost his stock. It was almost as if like, okay, I'm just gonna cool you down. Like, uh, you're just gonna take a second of not hitting me. Stay over there. Yeah, yeah. Nice carry on the last two of the down air. Okay. okay. If it doesn't work once, try it a second time. JDB looking in a good position to take this set if he can uh, close off this last stock right here. A star gonna have to figure out something right quick. Ooh. He's already in kill percent again. JDB's done some work this stock already. Yeah. I like to get up shield breaker. That would have gotten him a free stock instead of him. Really far off stage. Kept his jump. Really smart. And yeah, good forward tilt to cover the get up. Yep. Still a hill to climb to a for A star, but just one stock. Just one stock. Famous last words. <laughs> oh, <laughs> baiting out the, the landing, the landing aerial yeah. forward smash. Just disjointed enough to challenge it and make the kill. Yeah, and that forward smash, that forward smash has always been good. Oh yeah, but oh, yeah. It, it feels spicy meatball. real. It, it feels really good yeah. in this game. And yeah, I think the Mario, the Mario counter pick was exactly what JDB needed because he did lose that first game in Zinkling. Yeah. So swapping really to the Mario really paid off. Yeah, and.